Okay, our next project is we're going to be taking a piece of new canopy plastic. And as you can see, the windows are all contained with a big piece of plastic in them. Somebody at Fletcher has already cut a piece out they need it for some project. What we're going to be doing is showing how to cut this line. We won't be using a dremel tool or a razor knife. What we'll be using is a, a tool that we're going to cut at a 45 degree angle this line. We're going to free this piece from the plastic. The tool that we're using from Harbor Freight is nothing more than a high speed uh, angle head grinder. And on it, we have a roll lock pad that is not a roll lock, but it's actually a 36 grit sandpaper. It's fairly coarse, and that's what you want. Now, we're going to throw out a lot of plastic here. We're going to make a lot of noise, but this is what we're going to use to very rapidly go ahead and, um, and ease that plastic out of it. So basically, all we're doing is we're taking compressed air, and we find the line, and then at 45 degrees, we cut it. Running along at a 45 degree angle, we have now completely freed up one part of the side of this piece of plastic. We do the other three sides, and it'll be completely clear. So you can see it, if you don't hold it down hard enough, you'll see that it doesn't quite free it, and that's a simple matter to come back with a second pass, removing all the plastic, or you can take a razor knife and just cut it out.
there you go. One piece of plastic freed out of your canopy window. Now this is only the first very rough cut. There'll be a lot more trimming needed to go. Uh, you'll want to come back here with some sandpaper on a fairly long board and get a nice flat straight edge to keep in mind. This is where we're going to put window trim that's going to push right up against the canopy glass. We want a nice clean installation. But that's how you can very rapidly take a piece of plastic out and get your plastic ready for installing the canopy. We hope you've enjoyed this. As always, more videos on maintenance with GPA. Thank you for watching.